What's up, y'all? It's your boy Mario Homeslide794. Welcome to my YouTube channel. Today, I'm going to be showing you guys how to unlock 30 frames a second to 60 frames a second, how to get better performance on your Batman Arkham Knight um, for the PC. Um, really, because uh, it wasn't really optimized for the PC. I'm going to show you how to go in there, try to adjust some settings. Um, and to kind of get you some more better performance right now, I know if you can find it online, it's at a discounted price. So I'm going to use you the, give you the settings that I've been using to kind of get better performance. Um, so let's already go and, uh, let's get started. So first you're going to have to go into the actual folder that it was actually located in. It's a bit tricky to get to, but go to the drive that the actual, um, game is installed on right in your your PC so mine was in C drive then go into a uh, program files then load up steam then steam apps then go to common then the game Batman Arkham Knight BM game which will, I will go ahead and, and, and show you guys how to get there from the start so uh, load up my computer, go to the C drive, program files, then go down to Steam. That's where it was uh, downloaded to. Load up Steam apps. Then load up Common. Pull up the game that's actually downloaded, Batman Arkham Knight. Next, you're going to load up BM Game. All right, now we're going to go to config. I know it's a lot and it's a shame we have to do this stuff to get the game to run properly, but that's just the scenario that we are in and then load up BM system settings, double click it, make sure it loads up in a, um, in actual, a uh, notepad. Cause you're going to adjust some of these valves. Okay. Or these values. So, uh, First thing you're going to want to do is you're going to want to increase the FPS that's built in in the game, right? So what I use is I hit control find so you can find that specific one and just type in FPS, right? Hit find text. It's going to find the max FPS, right? So I, it's going to be 30 when you first do it. I have 144 Hertz refresh monitor. So I put mine to 40, 144. So you would just adjust this part, put in, you know, 60 frames a second, uh, 120, depending on your monitor, um, change that. And then hit, just go ahead and hit enter. The next thing we're going to do is we are going to adjust some other settings. So go ahead and type in B allow D three D nine, right? B allow d3 d9 i'll put all these words into the uh into the description uh hit enter and that's the one you're going to want msaa it was going to be false it's going to be false when you pull it up change that to true uh, basically it's going to give you another option it's going to allow you to actually use msaa with uh direct uh direct uh nine direct x nine uh, it's going to look better. It's also going to improve the performance as well. Um, also, uh, if you want to go ahead and add the texture resolution, go ahead and type that in. Texture resolution. Not that one, but it's actually going to be just texture resolution here. It's going to be one. Change that to two. Um, basically that's going to allow you to change the actual texture resolution from normal to high. Um, so it's going to look better as well. And then next you're going to want to go ahead and uh, do a few more things. These are actually going to improve the performance as well. You're going to want to, uh, turn off the, uh, turn off bloom. So just type in bloom, uh, turn that to false, right? It's going to be, uh, it's going to be true. Uh, make sure it says false. Next, you're going to want to turn off reflections. Oop. May have spelt it wrong.
Oh, it's, oh, I have to go up. Okay. Reflections. All right. It's going to be true. You know, you can definitely turn it off on false. And this really depends on, you know, your performance of your graphics card. Um, if, you're, if your graphics card isn't that powerful, I have a 980, so I'm going to leave it on. If you have like a 960 something you're trying to push, you're getting like that 30 to 40 frames a second you want more, um, you can turn that off as well. So those are the main ones, guys, that I've noticed that make a big difference um, in the game. Make sure when you close it, you save it. You save the actual assist, you save the actual uh, um, notepad, and then when you boot up the actual game, it's gonna have those higher uh, that higher cap on there. Uh, it's gonna be useful, and uh, I'll definitely leave these uh, these uh, things to kind of look up on the description of my page, just so it's a little bit more useful for you. Okay, alrighty, guys. I hope this was useful. Hope this helps and helps to improve the quality of the game. Alrighty, bye.